In this video I'll show you how to uh, connect your Galaxy A05 and A04 as well as A15 and 14 uh, phones uh, to your computer, uh, laptop or Mac basically. For, uh, you, so you can transfer files or transfer image to your computer or do stuff like that. And we will need our cable to do that. This is the same cable used to charge your device basically. Then make sure it's plugged in your phone and the device. And then, this is the most important step, you have to unlock your phone, if you've got some security on it, and open up. up. And it will show a small pop-up like this, uh, most likely. So we need to click access. So, so this is basically the uh, basic Android security feature. If you don't uh, click that, yeah, nothing really will happen. Anyway, if uh, this uh, window doesn't appear, as some, or sometimes on some phones it doesn't really uh, do that. We need to swipe from up to down like this. And uh, see, there's a notification. It will mostly likely say USB for charging or USB for something basically. So we click on that and click once more for more options. Then we need to select this option, uh, transferring files, or use uh, use device for file transfer tools. It will basically say something like this. So if you don't select this, nothing really will happen again. If for some reason you don't see this small window, or when you do it like that, it doesn't show this thing, there's most likely something wrong with either uh, the port of your phone or your charger. So the most common thing for these ports is basically uh, some lint gets stuck in it and it can't make a good contact. Even if it charges, it doesn't mean it will uh, work for data transfer. So we can easily clean this hole. Uh, if you actually check out my other videos, I have a really, very detailed guide on how to do that. However, in short, uh, you can take uh, maybe a very, very fine uh, sewing needle and brush it out. Just make sure you don't damage uh, the contacts there. Anyway, it's best if you check out my other video. Then uh, we can also take a simple small brush like this. Okay, uh, and take, take a few small strands from it like this. And we can use it to brush it out simply. Brush it out properly for a few seconds and make sure you hold it like that so all this junk falls out. Also a useful tool is a blower like this that blows a lot of force basically. So we can blow out any junk from the hole. However, a brush worked really, really well as well. Then if your charging port looks okay, uh, it might be possible that uh, your cable isn't uh, good for this process. Again, if even if it charges with the ca same cable and visually it appears okay, it doesn't automatically mean it will be okay for the data transfer, especially if this is not the original cable that the phone came with. So, your best bet is to try another cable, basically. Okay, once it's properly connected, it's uh, very easy now. So, um, we, on the windows, we have to go to the start menu and click uh, this PC basically. It might show some other thing depending on your Windows version. Then we click on the device name basically that appears and click on internal storage. If you want to access your images, the photos you took with your phone, they are located in this uh, DCIM folder. So click on that and click once more. A green bar, as you saw, appears there that indicates the progress. And make sure this uh, progress bar uh, finishes uh, this process and all the image load. If you start touching this image or doing something with them before it finishes, the whole process basically uh, will crash. So if you want to copy out the image, simply select the image you want, click copy, then we can make a new folder somewhere on the desktop and simply click paste and all the images will be copied to your computer basically. Then for example if you maybe want to uh, 
transfer some movies or music to your uh, phone so you can watch them there again uh, go to this main menu and there's actually a folder especially for movies and music however we can uh, paste them in uh, we can make even make a new folder as well if you don't want to use these so if you want to transfer for example movie to your phone you go to the source file on your computer and we can simply drag it drag it to the movies here and it will be copied there very shortly so that's how you do a uh, file transfer on basically all the Galaxy A series uh, phones. If this was helpful, make sure to hit the like button.